very quiet. It's the rare 2011 White Rhino, and it only can be seen at Vision Garage. What do you think about my open? No. <laughs> Welcome back to Vision Garage, guys. I know it's been a while, and finally, we've got something on the floor to sell. Man, it's been tight. We're going to talk about that in a moment, too, but uh, it's the rare white rhino. Yeah, we got excited about this, It's and as you watch this, you'll see what we're kind of talking about. It is kind of special. It is a little rare. Uh, it's got a unique package on it. Uh, the finish is, is like a snakeskin finish. Love it. I've never seen one like it. Um, so that's what kind of makes it unique, and that's kind of why we bought it. We uh, and it we caught thought, our eye. We it really, our yeah, eye. it and, really and, did. And, yeah, and it was a good unit. It's got a, it's got some miles on. It's got a little over four thousand. But once again, this 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 guy bought it. He had like twenty thirty acres. He had a house on on the property. He took care of the property. He's been when we bought it. He was building a house for his daughter. He never trailered it. He he kept it on the property. That's all he used it for. And, you know, it, it shows that, too. And we talk about it all the time. We work really hard to find good, clean vehicles. And, and I'm telling you, look at this vehicle. It still looks great. And this is, yeah. this is the unit that started it all. If you, you know anything about side-by-sides, uh, Yamaha came out with the 450 side-by-side, -side and it changed the side-by-side -side industry. It really started it. And, again, uh, the best word I can use for this vehicle is even in 2021 is how capable it is. It's capable of looking good. I think it's a great looking bike. It's capable on the trails. It's capable to go out and work on the farm all day. You can go riding on it. I mean, and and we took it out a couple weeks yeah. ago. We yeah. actually have a red one in here, guys. Yeah. As rare, as funny as it is, we have two. 2000, uh, uh, that's a 2009. It's the snakeskin red 700. It's the pinnacle. It's the high, it's, it's as good as it got. And we were really impressed. I had a blast on it. Yeah, How incapable yeah. it was out on the trails. Yeah, they, uh, it is. And not only that, the, <laughs> they're very comfortable. I've got a, a Can-Am Defender and this ride, as far as the seat and, and the way you sit in it is so much more comfortable. In my defense. They don't look like they'd be comfortable, but they're no, great. No, they, they don't. Really are. But yeah. this thing rides great on the trail. Uh, it, it, it just everything fits perfect, and it does well on the trail. Yeah, I was I really mean, it, impressed by yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. It's a great bike, and it's Yamaha. They're bulletproof. Parts are cheap, and you know, again, I go back. Look at it. Just yeah. look at it. It's yeah. a great it's, looking it's, bike. It is. It is. Yeah. And we've we've done a few things to it. Yeah. We've uh, we've it's got brand new tires. Brand new tires. Yeah. Uh, we've put brand new calipers on on the back and a brand new brake caliper. I don't know if you guys know how it works, but drive shaft's got a got a brake disc on it. It's that's how the emergency brake works. What else is new? Air filter. Air filter. Oil it's filter. Completely serviced like we always do. Oil changed. All the filters. Um, <laughs> So it's ready to go. There's ready to ride. Nothing you need to do. Yeah. This everything works as it should. Got a couple um, nice uh, uh, additional things. Roof. Yeah. Got the roofs. Got 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 the light bar on the top. Got a light bar on the front. Winch. Everything um, works. Everything works. Uh, the bed has the rails. Those are options if you you know see them in the pictures. Um, really clean in the bed too. Really we, clean. You know, we 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 put a little lipstick yeah. on it and repainted it up, yeah. but it wasn't wasn't bad at all. You know, this vehicle's not showing a lot of wear or rust in yeah. it anywhere. Look at the fenders on it; in great yeah. shape. It's got the uh, the cool chrome rims on it, and they, they've seen better days. But yeah. you can tell they still look good. And I mean, this is a very present presentable vehicle. Um, driver seat. You can see it's got some tape on it. That's the, really the only... Uh, yeah. We, uh, and we really we, debated what to do yeah, on it, because you can get one. Yeah. You know, if you wanted it 100% perfect, yeah, you can buy another seat for it. They're we 119 just, bucks. Yeah. We just, you know, we, we do got to kind of draw a line here and there. We don't want to have to replace everything, but this thing looks really good. Yeah. The seat's functional. Plastic's fully functional. in good shape. The snake skin looks really good yeah. on it. And I mean, again, um, it's just, uh, uh, and it rides great. Uh, yeah. I mean, everything works on it. And what I love about these old Yamahas, and a lot of people will get it, this is a this has true 
diff lock on yes, it. Yes, yes. Yeah, you can go to two wheel to four wheel drive and then flip the switch on it and lock this baby down. Yeah. And a lot, you know, there's a lot of people that complain. The newer bikes are great, they're all automatic, but some people and still wish that you could just press a button and control yes. and do yeah. that diff lock. And that's one of the things that make these Rhino 700s uh, so good. This also has the aftermarket Super ATV power steering kit on it too. Yes, yes. Yeah, which so. makes it easy to drive. Yeah. Um, again, I love these things. I, yeah. I still think they're great bikes. So some of you guys are looking at this right now and going, well, you know, that's a that's a $5,500, $6,000 bike. And you know what? It was a year and a half ago. Right. But inventory is just so tight. You were over at the local dealer the other yeah. day, and, you know, they, they, they were sharing with him that... Yeah, we, I was over there, and I, and I noticed, once again, uh, the floor, floor had, the showroom had no units on it none upstairs it's two-story they have none in their storage um they, and they were just telling me that they had like 460 units that people put money down on and they're waiting for them to come in 460 units that's incredible yeah yeah i mean so the dealers aren't getting dealer stock they the manufacturers are basically filling uh pre-orders and you know that's true uh in the rv business and uh you know car dealers selling them as they come off the off the truck um you know it's going to be like that for a while until inventory and manufacturing can catch yeah, back up yeah and of course that affects the used market because then those prices go up and then they become hard to find as well at least good used ones i mean yeah um there's always units out there that you know are kind of rough you always find those but um we we are having a hard time finding bikes as well. We haven't been on in a while, but yeah. uh, you know when we find a clean one, obviously you know we put our time and effort into it to make it so you don't have to do anything but get on and ride it. And it's been tough, and it's uh, made the market tight. So again, I could price these. You know, and the other thing, I, let me talk real quick about you know our pricing too. You know, we try to price these for what we think is fair. So if you call us and go, well, or they offer us a thousand dollars or five hundred dollars less, we just can't do that. And again, I'd rather if I priced it so that you could come down five hundred dollars, you'd wow. laugh at us and you'd laugh at me. And you'd never even look at this bike because I'd have to price it so that I could negotiate to what you used to be able to in the old days. So we work real hard on yeah. just trying to give a fair price for a fair bike. Very good condition for the year. Again, a 2011, uh, uh, about 4,500 miles on it. I think about 426 yeah. hours on it. So it's been used, and uh, but again, in really great shape. And you can tell. And this is a sharp. I mean, white's kind of unique anyway. You don't see a lot of white side by side out there but i think it looks great it, it, yeah. it's kind of a unique piece once is, again if you yeah. really want something a little different uh this is it so again guys if you have any questions you know feel free to email us but i would suggest you call us um numbers on the bottom of the screen call kirk uh get in touch with us we'll uh hook you up set you up to come look at it uh, as always you yep. know we're very fortunate Good. in the fact that you know our bikes don't last long we've talked about it before uh we work really hard um, none of them are new, and but we go through them. We have our hands just about on every piece of this bike and work really hard to get it so that you're ready to jump on the trail and go riding. Take care. Thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you on the trails. Yep, we'll see you out there.